My first visit to Malaysia with uh, some sightseeing by visiting the Batu Caves, for example, it was colorful and unique by all the stairs you have to climb and a lot of uh, monkeys around, so you have to be careful that they don't grab your food. But for me, it's something completely different than what we see in the Netherlands. So uh, that was a great experience to, uh, to visit the caves. Malaysian local food, sometimes for lunch, uh, sometimes we went to the mall, just uh, grab a quick lunch at uh, one of the many restaurants you see everywhere. And one night for dinner to a local restaurant, yeah, I let them pick the food uh, so I could try all the different dishes, the rice, the shrimps, the meat, it was very, very tasteful. The food was not, not too spicy, a little bit, but actually I love my food being a little bit spicy. Uh, maybe not so extreme in, in many parts of Asia that uh, we're not used to, but uh, I love my food a bit spicy. Kalau tengok nama dia, mesti korang macam pernah jumpa kat mana aku jumpa Mohamad ni sebenarnya. Okay, Philip Koku. Look at his record, playing over 100 caps for the Netherlands. Six years at Barcelona, one of the biggest clubs on the planet. Being captain of the club, PSV, his career in Holland. Phenomenal player and uh, a real gentleman. Koku tu lah, sebab dia macam nampak seorang yang pendiam. Macam tak banyak cakap, tapi sebenarnya benda tu salah. Dia jujur lah, senang cakap dia jujur. Dia Bila dia borak dengan aku, dia jujur. The interviews, of course, we spoke a lot about football, about my own career as a player for the national team, for Barcelona, uh, playing the Champions League. So, it's a great interview session. Puas sebab soalan aku pendek, tapi dia cerita betul-betul, dia bagi tahu apa yang dia nak share. So, puas. Now, of course, the topics of the, of the World Cup uh, came by, what's important for Astro, with the launch for the quest for the World Cup. I've had a very warm welcome, very friendly people. The launch in the mall was, I think, was great. I met the, the two guys of so Bolivar interview. Was more a little bit more casual, mesmerizing. Mesmerizing itu kalau perkataan Hang, aku ikonik lah. Perjalanan kerja dia tu memang sangat-sangat ikonik. Going actually quite deep in my own career, especially my first uh, stay at PSV with Ronaldo and, and Niles. Jadi bila dia kata dia punya favorite player yang dia pernah main alongside Ronaldo, Ronaldinho tu aku macam tak banyak manusia kat dunia ni yang boleh cakap dia pernah main dengan Ronaldo, Ronaldinho eh. Tapi memang elok lah, Philip Koku tadi memang legend habis lah. How was League of Legends to Philip Koku? Well, it's in the name. Legend, right? That man is a legend and a heart. Oh, brilliant. The interview with Adam was a bit longer, so there was more time to talk about football in general, going in, into the matters a little bit more deep. Yeah. Don't believe it, follow your dreams, work hard, and you can make them real. I did the uh, meet and greet in the mall for Astro, which I love to do. So we spent some, some more time together. People who work for Astro and join us and, and taking care of us in a, in, a, in a great way. So if I had one word to describe Philip Koku, it would be legend. I think it says it all. Michelle, very professional, uh, great knowledge about the game of football, perfectly prepared, easy to talk to, love working with her. Adam also, a lot of knowledge about the game, about us, like if, when we visit the career of myself. You feel at home, you feel welcome and at ease uh, to work with both. Yeah, it's been a pleasure. In general, my stay at the hotel has been excellent, fantastic room, people very helpful, with good facilities. Work with Astro has been really, really professional setup in everything we did. I'm really pleased I could be part of it, and uh, well, hopefully, I can come back in the future again. Okay?